Hello all. Today we're excited to share Segments, a new functionality from Wheelhouse designed to help you slice, dice, and analyze your portfolio with ease. We're going to do a quick intro of what Segments are before stepping into a demo and a quick close. So first, the definition. Segments are dynamic views that you can create or save based on a bunch of different characteristics, both most specifically listing attributes, such as one bedroom, two bedroom, or a particular market, or any other number of things, or listing performance. So you could look at occupancy, the number of recent bookings, et cetera. You can combine those, and there's actually a lot more to it. So let's take an example. Let's say every Monday, you want to open up Wheelhouse and confirm the occupancy and pacing of five at-risk listings. Okay, scenario number one. Or let's say you've got a new teammate you're training and that same Monday, you just wanna check out how they're doing with their portfolio. Or you have a different problem. You wanna see quickly which listings are booking fast and have a lot of block nights. Why? Well, possibly you wanna communicate to the owner, hey, we've seen a lot of bookings at your property. Are you sure you wouldn't like to open up a few more nights? These are revenue generating activities that you can more easily do with segments. So before segments, you could have sliced and diced of these views. It would require filtering and a little bit of time. But after segments, instant insights, right? We wanna be able for you to pull this information instantly and be able to make a move. So your portfolio, slice however you please. We think you're gonna love it. Let's dive in and learn a little bit more. I'm now in my wheelhouse portfolio, just to orient ourselves a bit. You can see all my listings here on the left side. As you probably know, I can load up to a thousand listings at a time in Wheelhouse and look up to 500 days in the future as I scroll through the dates. Next, I have a column with tags in it. I can add as many tags as I want to my listings. They're a way to organize data that we're gonna get a chance to see a little bit more of in just a second. And then these next five columns are all metrics. I can select which metrics I wanna see at any time, adjusting them here. But in this case, for this demo, these are the metrics I wanna see. Now, for segments, let's say that I had a view I wanted to quickly see. In this case, I want to be able to see all my properties with a large number of bedrooms. And as you probably know in Wheelhouse, you can stack your filters, meaning if I want to see my large properties in some new markets that I don't know as well as my others, I'm going to be able to do this. And all these filters are very easy to change as well. So this is a group of filters. And if I want to create a segment, because I'm going to see them often. I'm going to save this segment. I'm going to say live demo because yes, this is a live segment demo for something we're sharing soon. And now what I can do is whenever I select this demo from the dropdown, I will come back to these filters. Now, in this case, I've saved some earlier segments as well. So say I've got a revenue management team. I've got four people on my team. And for each teammate, I want to make sure that they tag their at-risk properties. In this case, I've asked Amelia, one of my teammates, to tag any of the properties that she sees at risk. You can see that here. You can see it in the tag, et cetera. And I can quickly cut to this view and I can do this for any number of teammates, right? So I can save Amelia's portfolio, Amanda's portfolio, or any portfolio that I want, okay? Now, let's say I also wanted to look every Monday at properties that were booking well but had a lot of block nights. Now for my portfolio, these are all demo properties, so I actually don't have any blocked nights. But what you'll be able to see is that this filter can look at the number of nights booked in the last 14 days. And this is saying that I want to make sure the number is greater than 10, less than 100. Um, so more than 10 nights have booked in the last 14 days. And in this case, this column, we have filtered out all the properties that aren't booking quickly. And what I might do with this combination of data of fast booking properties and block nights is immediately message these owners and let them know their property is booking well, should we open up a few more nights, right? That is information you might wanna to communicate to get more nights to sell. Now, I can also take other filters. In this case, I've asked those, uh, I've looked for some new owners. I put new owner tags on in this case. And I want to see the properties that in the next 90 days have too low of an occupancy. This could be two, one of two problems. One, maybe the owner is asking to keep the prices higher than we think they should, than they should. Or B, maybe our strategy isn't working and the owner is starting to get a little anxious. But in any case, for a new property, I might want to keep a more precise view. So as you can see, all these slices and dices of the portfolio are available instantly now that I've got these, now that I have these segments set up. So 
Segments is a faster, easier way to slice your portfolio. You can do so based on attributes, based on performance, listing performance characteristics. You can combine them in any way you want. And in a couple of weeks, we'll see, we'll show even a cooler way you can carry these segments across the rest of the wheelhouse site. If you've ever made it to the end of one of our videos, you probably know we'd like to take the last minute to talk a little bit about the difference between dynamic pricing and revenue management and why this is important for you. So dynamic pricing helps with automation. It's all about leveraging demand signals near you to price your listings more perfectly. However, revenue management is a different art. It combines dynamic pricing, but also is designed for speed and control. The goal of revenue management is to help you create, evaluate, and edit strategies that are perfect for you and your owners as quickly as possible. Dynamic pricing is great for hosts, but Wheelhouse is really designed to deliver revenue management solutions for aspiring and already professional portfolios. Wheelhouse is designed for pros, which is why I hope you see why Segments, which gives you the ability to slice, dice, and analyze your portfolio with ease, is going to save you time and make revenue management a whole lot more fun. Cheers, and have a great day.